Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 15, and this is war number 10. And we're going up against this alliance here called Maximum Effort. So I've already scouted out my path, and I have chosen the team that I'm going to go in here with. Spider-Man Stark Enhanced, Omega Red, and Gladiator Hulk. So Gladiator Hulk is for Path 1. If you've watched my uh, Alliance War videos, you know I always take Path 1. And Gladiator Hulk is king. I have not lost with Gladiator Hulk on this path. I got close to losing when I fought MODOT, um, but that was some shenanigans, some Alliance War shenanigans. So first up, we've got Blade. Now, our opponents have chosen Defense Tactics Siphon. That is the popular one now. And Doom is the popular defender. He is definitely OP with that global. All right, so you see there, I got parried, but it didn't matter. And Gladiator Hulk still wrecked him. Now, in the next fight, I want you to watch Gladiator Hulk's health. So, he is poison immune. I'm running suicides. Every time I fire a special, I take recoil damage. However, because on path one, you have starburst, the reason that Gladiator Hulk is king for this path is because it activates his face me. When his face me is active, he hits harder and he heals up most of the damage that he takes while face me is active. All right, you see there? The degen from starburst activated it. And look at his health. All right. Now, I'm playing it a little carefully. You saw how I dashed back and she pounced. I was ready because the AI likes to do that. You know, we're both standing there looking at each other. As soon as I dash back, the AI instantly attacks. All right. So, you see here, fired off my special two. I took recoil damage briefly, but you see how I healed most of it up? And just look at his health. That is why Gladiator Hulk is a beast for this path. Now, this Hela is not awakened, so we don't have to worry about her cheat death. All right, so I'm just slow playing it. I'm not in any hurry to take down this Hela. Look at Gladiator Hulk's health again, in case you missed it. Remember, we took some damage in the last fight. He's gotten more health than he was. And that is because he is poison immune and the healing combined with willpower and the recovery mastery, I'm actually getting back more health than if I didn't have that mastery maxed out. All right, so as usual, I don't take this mini boss here, even though I could. Uh, I have Omega Red with me now Normally, I don't take it because I never brought a solution for that first boss. And the guy who takes Psychic Thorns already has a solution that he's using. So it just makes sense for him to go ahead and take that mini. Uh, also, when they usually clear that mini, I'm asleep. So they would have to wait for me to wake up to take that mini, which they could and they have done in the past. All right, so we're in section two, and you saw that they did not place a defender on that first node. Now I'm having to deal with Ultron. And the defense tactic siphon is in effect. Uh, and if you're unfamiliar with that, it gives them a lot more damage, a lot more block penetration anytime they make contact with you. Um, and it's on a timer. So you want to, even when you parry, you see that I parried, you see that a uh, little icon that is uh, winding down there, counting down. See, he's got two now. If he hits me, even into my block, does a lot of damage. And if your opponent has high attack, base as well as from the node, it's insane. And that is why you see so many dooms. Now, our opponents, uh, there were, I think, a couple of dooms that I saw in this BG alone. All right, you see Doom up there. 
Um, and there was another Doom. I think in, one of the mini bosses was Doom on power. Um, there was another mini that was Doom, and then the boss was Doom. I believe we had, let me see, yeah, power, boss. Uh, there was another Doom down, I think, in the middle somewhere. Uh, but all in all, there were like four Dooms, and you just saw three of them. Okay, and I know there was at least four. I don't know if there was more than that, but there were at least four. All right, so we uh, cleared section two. And they went ahead and cleared that. What uh, one of my alliance mates does is when he finishes off his path, he boosts up. So he clears his path, clears the mini, clears the next one, and then calls it a night. And he usually does this after I'm asleep. So I try to make sure that um, he's clear so that when he is able to move, he's able to do that. So... At this point in time, the war is very, very close. I mean, it's really close. Uh, I don't believe their diversity is good. I mean, you had four dooms at least. And I asked for a direction. And I was told to go for this Killmonger. Now, I'm not going to tell you anything about this fight. I'm going to get out of your way and let you go ahead and watch it. And I will be back when the fight is over. I never want to hold you back. I wanna give you every chance to make it, to make it. I'm afraid if our love collides, you'll leave me alone tonight. Cause I'm changing and I'm breaking. Is this over? I'm scared to ask these questions cause I know that you'll reject my love. How do you like that for a nail biter? But you know what? I'm still standing here and he's not. And I didn't die. All right. So that's it for my fighting. We actually did have a couple of fights uh, on the boss, but they were not much to speak of. If you were watching on my live stream, I went in with Starkey and I didn't even get a chance to hit Doom. It was ridiculous. I was trying to build up the poise charges. And when I was trying to go after him, he caught me and the fight was just over. Doom has high base attack um, and they have the defense siphon and he had the node buffing his attack. It's ridiculous. 
The fight was over so quickly, it wasn't even funny. Um, not fun. Not fun at all. Uh, then I went in just to say I did because we already uh, used up our attack bonus, so we just needed to get him down. I went in with Gladiator Hulk, and I think I took 1% off of his uh, health. And then he got a shock on me and then backslapped me. One shot, I was gone. So, not fun. Anyway, we'll be back to find out how we did in this war. At this point, I believe we've won. We have beat them on kills, and I am pretty sure we have them beat on diversity. So, let's see how we did. And we're back, and we're about to find out how we did in this war. Let's see, tap anywhere to continue. And we won. All right, that is awesome. Yeah, their diversity was not so good. Uh, all those dooms, they went for the hard defense and we were able to beat them in the uh, kills and in diversity. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day.